green corridor has been created and uh, hospitals which are there in sector 93A and B close by, that is Yatharth Hospital and also JP Hospital, they have been put on standby. Amit Singh, Group CEO of uh, Yatharth Hospital is joining us as well. Amit, what is the preparations that have been put in place at your hospital and uh, are there some doctors on standby, emergency services, what are you looking at here? Yeah, so uh, we are very much prepared. Uh, all, all ambulance services, our emergency department, we have deployed extra manpower to manage any kind of eventualities. We have also created a separate space, uh, separate beds preparations. So, I mean, start from the ambulances till the, even if required some admissions, we are they're very much prepared. All teams are geared up, they are there. Let's, just, yes. let's hope for the best. Hmm. Yes, we are certainly hoping for the best and we are certainly hoping that, there is, that everything goes as per plans. But let's, you know, evaluate the risk as well. This is the reason why hospitals are on standby and that's what uh, the CP of NOIDA told CNN News 18 just minutes ago. Amit, uh, just tell us which, how many beds are on standby and in terms of uh, uh, the doctors that you say, the emergency doctors that have been uh, called to the hospital, are the... What is the specialization like? See, we have created an entire floor, uh, which is uh, already been vacated and created especially for this. Right? Our emergency services, we have doubled the staff everywhere. So doctors are very much ready. And all the, uh, the I mean, visually we handle lots of emergencies. Such eventualities, our team is very much ready. So number of staff had been uh, doubled. In some of the areas, we have tripled the staff. And my medical administrations fully sitting over there and monitoring the situation. Yes, how many uh, ambulances have been moved from Yatharth Hospital to the neighboring societies here in sector 93, close to so the Twin got, Towers? Uh, uh, we have got uh, five ambulances very much ready with the CLS and BLSS, and a couple of them are standby. So, because since we have uh, three hospitals uh, adjacent in 10 kilometers, this thing, so we have a uh, standby uh, ambulances kept in other hospitals as well, so that their team is also ready. So, if any eventuality, any even if a situation arises, uh, my uh, second line backup team is uh, ready to you know take it over. And what is the second line uh, backup team that you're looking at? So we have. Uh, Could you we give have us details another, of that? So we have another hospital in our extension and a greater Noida. So their emergency team has also been put on alert. Yes. So the, our deployments are there, so the team is ready. However, uh, the, our uh, Noda Exodus uh, hospital is very much prepared itself. So I don't think so it's a requirement, but if any something comes up, we are there in just a couple of minutes away. And you said that one full floor of Yatharth Hospital has been put on standby with medical staffs, nurses, doctors, everyone uh, present there. Have they arrived at the hospital already? Because in another one and a half hours, uh, this entire building Absolutely. will be brought down. Absolutely. Entire administration team is there. My medical superintendents of the uh, both the three units are there. Uh, they, are, they are already in uh, 110 hospitals. Uh, it's a couple of minutes back I inquired about the preparations and then everything is, is, is it's, uh, uh, I mean, as per the plan. So we are very much ready. And a bit, where, yes, and when did the Noida, Noida Authority get in touch with the hospitals nearby, including yours, uh, for assuring the precautions are being taken of this nature, particularly of any kind of medical emergency here? Absolutely. So they're very much in touch with us since last couple of days. In fact, uh, probably today, in fact, uh, the team is already there, Noda, uh, the CMO office, the team is there. I think uh, additional CMO is already in our hospital. So we were in couple of, uh, since last couple of days in touch. Uh, they had come and inspect the place and then the, as whatever the, you know, preparatory uh, things were there, we, we uh, followed the guidelines and we did it together. All right, Amit, thank you so much for joining us. So, precautionary measures being taken in all the neighboring hospitals, green corridor created. Uh, medical staffs of these hospitals are already present there to ensure that in case of any untoward accident, the, the, the people are taken care of immediately. Um, ambulances have been placed outside most of those societies. The fire brigade is there, the sprinklers are there, so to handle uh, particularly the rise of that cloud of dust that we are anticipating but does it all stop at this tv spectacle this is the tv spectacle that is
authority, but what about accountability? Will the authority ensure that it doesn't just stop at the suspension of two junior ranking officers and the entire nexus exposed?